Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 3, and today we're going to be talking about the Episode 15 synopsis and going through some new information that I have that is actually different from the synopsis. It's just a really small thing, but I thought I would include it in this synopsis video because the synopsis was released a few days ago. And so if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any Supergirl videos later this year. The episode is titled In Touch of lost time and obviously that sparks a lot of ideas and a lot of theories and we've talked about those and I will actually link those theories and all the other stuff to do with the episode in the description below. So this is how the synopsis goes. When Miran inadvertently causes psychic disturbances at the DEO, Supergirl must work with Jean to contain the resulting chaos. Meanwhile, mon begins training Kara in fighting techniques he's learned in the future for battling world killers. So there's a lot of stuff to cover in this synopsis. There's quite a lot of new news. So we know that Miran is actually going to be sick and that is the reason for the psychic disturbance is much like if you guys have seen the film Logan Patrick Stewart's character he becomes mentally ill and he causes these psychic disturbances so if you've watched that movie that's roughly what it's going to be like and Moran's going to be ill and that's what's going to be happening but he'll be fine and he will just have to bear through it for the next few episodes because we know he's appearing in other episodes. So the next part of the synopsis is that mon will be training Kara in fighting techniques he's learned from the future for battling world killers. So the key part here is he's learned techniques for battling specifically world killers. So they know about the threat in the future and they've trained for the idea of that they could actually fight well killers. So if you guys didn't know, in the future the main reason why the blight are there is due to pestilence and pestilence releases a virus that actually in turn causes the blight so they have to use those techniques to take down the blight and that's what they've been doing. So a lot of people have been raving about this so a lot of people that don't like mon are like, how does this work? Why on earth would mon actually train Supergirl? But the thing is, yes, Monel got his ass handed to him by Rain, but he's never actually fought a world killer before. He's fought the remnants of the world killers, so that is the blight. So he actually has never actually for a full-on world killer and so he's probably going to use those techniques. He really got jumped upon when it was him versus Rain and so I think he will show, you know, his true colours as to his fighting in this episode and he's going to try, emphasis on try, to help Kara actually defeat Rain when she's actually fighting her. So obviously it's just going to be a bit of time where Kara and Monel can actually get past this awkwardness and that is the next thing that I've got. So we know after this episode, there's not going to be any more Kara and mon awkwardness. They're going to be back to normal like they were in season two. There's not going to be much romantic stuff, but it's all going to be normal. And it will be normal conversations, not just, you know, one conversation per episode, which starts off awkward, then it goes to normal. After this, they're going to be fine and back to normal. And I'm really excited for that. I've really enjoyed seeing their progression as to getting back to normal standards with each other. And so probably the biggest part of episode 15 is actually that mon is finally going to be suiting up in that comic book red and blue suit. And I'm really excited that's going to be happening in this episode. We don't know how he gets the suit. I'm supposing it's from Wim because he's in present day right now. And he's the guy that makes the suit. So I'm really excited. Hopefully it's going to be really awesome on screen. And that's all I've got for you guys today. If you did enjoy this video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. And also, please be sure to enter the giveaway for the new Supergirl Season 3 return poster. I'm going to be giving away a load of those. Go in the link in the description below and go to that video that I posted yesterday. Leave a like and a comment on that video and you can be automatically entered. I'm going to be giving away to a lot of people. So please be sure to share it around with your friends. A lot of people will be winning the prize. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Strong, it doesn't make us weak. Tongue tied to service like shy.